Don't be yelling in my ear with that ricky rack, that rickety rack. <laughs> I'm not crying alone in a room from the 1900s. I'm not doing that. <laughs> We have one. Do I like the ghost of Christmas past staying in this room? <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome to this week's weekly vlog. I hate it when this thing isn't open. So I just pulled up at Nordstrom Rack, right? Today is, Wednesday? what's today, Wednesday? Today's Wednesday, September 6th. It is 4.41 p.m. and this chin has been giving me, girl. I need to quit eating so much foul. Anyways, so I'm about to head into Nordstrom Rack right now and we're gonna go grab i don't know there's a couple things that i want a uh, jewelry maybe a clutch I got on this sweatshirt because lately i haven't felt like wearing like just my fitness outfits out i want like something baggy on top i don't know what that's about am i growing up like i don't know i don't like it but it's way too hot for this so i may see if i can find um something to throw on on top of this because i have on like a gray workout outfit and i want it to match so hopefully they have something this color because that would be great do i need it no but i do need it for like just wearing stuff now this sweatshirt it's like it's a lot i know people gonna be like oh i know you look hot girl i'm not hot i'm always cold so i should be fine why are you looking at me okay so i popped in a headphone now one thing about me one thing i'm gonna do is put a headphone in while i'm shopping i don't know i can't listen to the store music y'all store music be trash so i will pop a headphone in the headphones i've been using for years are the bolton headphones these are what the headphones look like um i love these headphones i'm not buying no um apple uh headphones like at that point girl we're going too far okay because i know they're really expensive so i much rather use these bolt tune they sound good and if i lose them i'm not gonna be stressed now if i lost a, like a 199 dollar headphone i'm stressed out these are 40 bucks and they sound good and they've been working for years like i never had an issue with them and surprisingly i haven't lost them so where the wood at? ain't no wood grain in here knock on uh fiberglass <laughs> Okay, let's let's go inside. I took off that sweatshirt. It's way too hot. Can you see my deodorant? Ugh, natural deodorant does that to a girl. All right. Well, let's head on in. Got my keys. Got my headphone. We are all set. Let's go inside and see if we can shop a little bit. Y'all, why didn't I recognize there's an awesome beauty section? Look at these earrings. Look how cute. Brow pencils from NYX. Girl, why am I looking around? They have fragrances. Mm. I need to smell them though. Like, how do I know if they're good? Like, I don't know. fragrances. Okay, so we're back in the car. I did shopping and girl, I don't know how to shop. That's what I realized. I don't know how to shop. I don't like shopping. So we end up getting a whole bunch of nothing. Did I put my hand sanitizer on? Is there hand sanitizer? Oh, where's my hand sanitizer? Oh, ooh. where's my hand sanitizer? Oh God, why am I about to panic? Oh, I think I have hand sanitizer in my bag. I definitely have hand sanitizer somewhere. No, oh yes I do. Oh baby, I keep hand sanitizer everywhere these little minis this is from my dentist's office but every time i go for a visit or I get new trays they give me a new batch oh i gotta reschedule my shit girl my physical and my dentist appointment is made on the same day and my dentist appointment was made like a couple months ago and my my physical was made a year ago and how did i end up doing it on the same day like september 11th like and i'm not going to either of them because i'm going to be out of town for a wedding <laughs> so what if I won't be out of town on september 11th but i'll be tired on september 11th so i'll still be mentally out of town so i wanted to show y'all what i got i don't know what's wrong with me but the way i shop mm -mm. i picked up so much stuff 
and I will literally go back and put things back in their rightful place on the rack okay I will get it and then I'll look at it before I go to the register and I'll say if I'm gonna wear this again you like it yes do you love it mm, yes or no do you think this will go with your outfit or what you're looking for yes but are, do you think you're gonna wear it again no and if the answer is no if I'm not gonna wear it more than once I'm not buying it and if I'm not uh unless it's like a dress like usually like dresses I can justify like event dresses because how many events do you go to it's obvious that you're probably gonna wear that dress once or twice um like dresses that I wear to weddings and stuff like that if it's an accessory or something like that I'm not gonna buy it tennis shoes, like I gotta wear it more than once so I'm gonna show y'all what I got I got like four things so I got nothing <laughs> They do have a good makeup section, like I told y'all. So I got these uh, NYX Micro Brow Pencils. I don't even know how much this was. But I got... How much were these Micro Brow Pencils? $10.45? Is that how much they cost? Girl, I don't even know how much these things cost. I never look because I just buy them. So I got these Micro Brow Pencils from NYX. Y'all know I love these. And I want to keep one in my bathroom, in my makeup cabinet, and in my travel bag. So I got a black and espresso one. Today I'm wearing the black black may be a little bit harsh but brown i don't you know it don't really be doing much why are both my hands full so the next thing i bought which i was like i will wear this again and this is cute and i haven't seen anything like this on amazon or anything but this is a necklace from panacea and it's like a it's this harem bone a harem bone necklace and a little lock and key which i thought would be really really cute for my dress that i'm wearing to this wedding Cause that's what i was looking for i was looking for stuff for wearing to this wedding and the last thing like i told y'all i wanted to find something i'm about to put this jacket on now it's about to it's getting cool but this is a 90 degree by reflex jacket it's super cute it has a pocket in the back friend look it has a pocket in the back why do we need a pocket in the back i don't know oh is there something in my ear but this is a jacket it's kind of like a cropped fitness jacket i need more fitness jackets as we get to fall and this was only what it said 29.97 but i got also got five percent off with what's five percent off it was 28.47 and i also got an extra ten dollars off because of the nordstrom notes but i'm gonna put this jacket on now is that gross i don't know but i don't feel comfortable walking around like this like i don't know what it is Plus, I need to try this on. Girl, I got deodorant all up in my armpit. So, if it don't fit, girl, it don't fit. Okay, it fits. Oh, this is cute. <clears throat> Extra small would have been better. This is a size small. But since I've gained some weight, I don't feel like, I don't know, like my waistline, you know, I just don't feel comfortable. I like to have on like a jacket. It makes me feel like, lately, I just don't feel like I want something on top. I don't know what that is about i feel more finished and this is what it looks like it's cropped has pockets it's cute oh girl how about you pop the tag off can i can i pop this off without pulling a hole in it oh girl this is intense hold on oh, there we go got one how's he how do you get this off? girl this is gonna have to pop down okay that's cool I'm keeping this jacket. Oh, my battery's about to die. Let me put this in the trunk. <laughs> and then, yeah. We're gonna get on the road because I have to go to the vitamin store and get some oil of oregano because I use it on my face. Baby, that's the burn too. Let's get on the road, friend. Let's go ahead and vibe out. I'm gonna drive my way up to, listen to some Alina Barras and drive my way up to the vitamin shop. They close at six, so let me hurry up and get up there. It's gonna rain too, girl. What is going on? Too little of you. Hey. Anybody else I'll be gone by now I'll be 
I'm at Ulta because I have to make a return for a couple of things that I got what was this a while ago um I got two items a while ago that I did not want did not like I thought I was getting like I don't know what I thought I was getting but I got a couple things from NARS let's see is it in here and the wrong like skincare product so i'm going to take these things back but i don't think i'm gonna vlog in there because i don't like people telling me what to do my attitude would be real bad when somebody said oh you can't film me here and i'm like really i can't <laughs> i don't have an attitude let me get out of here it's the next day i'm just at ulta coming to pick up i came to pick up my um this stuff my holy holy grail skincare stuff the Avene c caliphate plus hydrating recovery skin emulsion i'm addicted to this i feel like it saves my skin maybe it did maybe it didn't i don't know but i came to pick that up and now i'm headed back home Turn that off. i'm headed back home um because we have to have breakfast it's noon on thursday i'm having breakfast and then i'm headed wait what am i saying girl i can't do <laughs> I can't drive and talk like what's going on I'm gonna have breakfast first have my protein shake because I didn't have it before I leave because I was rushing out of the house um, and then I'm going to me and my husband are gonna go pick up our rental car because we are going out of town for a wedding my cousin-in-law his wedding to his beautiful wife Esther so yeah we are um <clears throat> we're gonna be going to their wedding this weekend we're also going to be traveling with my brother-in-law so he'll be coming in tonight um, so we can head out in the morning together so that's what we're doing today so i'm going to run by the store real quick i have a couple more things to pick up and then we're gonna head home but i wanted to catch y'all up yesterday what did i get i got um i went to ulta yesterday oh yeah that's what it was Ye yesterday when i went to ulta they did not have this product on the floor and they were really really busy so i don't like asking somebody for something when i know you have it in stock and then they're like busy so they're not gonna look as hard because when i worked in retail if i if <laughs> i would look hard but like if it's really really busy you don't have time to look for the product so i ordered it online while i was in the store for pickup so I could come in today and pick it up so they'll have time to look for the product and um because they said they had it in stock so if they told me no they didn't have it in stock then I would never did the order you know you know what I'm saying I did my toes this morning and I'm about to do my nails um I don't know if I'm gonna do my nails when I get home or when I, we get back I also have to edit my Amazon braided wig video which y'all should have seen on Friday this video should be out on Sunday or Monday so yeah I'm gonna do my Amazon braided wig haul which I'm so excited about editing that and that's it that's what's on the agenda today and we have to pack so and I gotta put my wig on for the weekend and I'm trying to figure out which wig I'm gonna wear oh yeah and last thing I got my clothes from Jlux label girl I did two or three days shipping but I did it on a holiday so the product this the clothes didn't show up until today girl and I ordered it on September 2nd and I ordered I did two to three day shipping which I paid the extra like 21 22 dollars to get it here in time because I needed to find something find a dress for the wedding and lately for weddings I've been wearing house of CB but baby it's been too expensive I'm not doing it no more hey y'all so i'm back and better than ever <laughs> no i'm back am i sweating girl it's hot out here i'm sweating sorry but we are at sixth rent a car i picked up my husband and we came back to get um we came back to get uh our rental car for today because i told y'all earlier that we're gonna head out for our trip tomorrow so 
we got another bmw like so we have this thing we love renting with six because we can get get the same car because we like to drive the same car that we actually drive so we know the controls in it and it's just easy to just punch it because when you're learning new cars i cannot learn a new car can't do it no ma'am um uh, we're here to pick up the car that's i don't even know why i went into all that i just made i made my smoothie for breakfast it's 12 51 so i'm having breakfast late um i made a protein shake with protein milk so my protein shake is different this time because i try not to put anything acidic or anything chocolate anything that's going to irritate my stomach so i do protein milk protein powder from whole foods like no sugar no nothing just pea protein vegan protein vegan protein powder and then i put pecans date syrup maple syrup oh i forgot the cinnamon it's actually good without the cinnamon sometimes i'll put cinnamon in there because it's good with cinnamon but i didn't do cinnamon today and frozen bananas brown frozen like the ripe frozen bananas but this is so good it tastes like ice cream like this tastes like ice cream it literally have treat your feet like this is literally a foot massage place group events and couples massage what they doing to people feet in there <laughs> i was about to start judging <laughs> there's nothing wrong with a foot massage but i don't know why i think a foot massage place is weird this real cute girl just walked in there though she's really pretty i should get my feet massaged while i'm over here talking about these people anyways honey now we're headed home okay it's been a busy morning girl i don't move this much what are you doing Video real quick. Okay. Sure okay. I love you. Okay. I'll see you at the house. Okay, I love you. Okay, so I guess I'm headed home. Right. We're headed to the home. Lately I've been into just more calming, soothing music. Um instead of like listening to like the turn up music. Like I like a little calming, soothing, you know, slow vibe sort of thing. So of course, I love Alina Baraz. Um, it's the Sade like vibe, you know, a little bit of smoothish, something on the smooth jazz channel, but except, except now, like that's the stuff that my dad always used to used to when he drove around or talk radio. And I don't know what it is about getting older, child. But you get into your thirties, baby, you just want to be, you want peace. Don't be yelling in my ear with that Ricky rack, that rickety rack. <laughs> I give it all. To you somebody tell me the answers me you isn't the answer me you isn't okay we're back home from picking up the car finally i got my j looks label package i really thought i wasn't gonna get it so i have to try on this stuff now to figure out if it's gonna work and if not i need to go pick up a dress which i feel like i won't need to right usually j looks label fits i think i only got like a couple of things that i didn't like so Let's see. Okay, so I got some slacks. Slacks. Oh, I got this. I forgot. Got this white bodysuit to go with it. The dress for the wedding that looks really thin. And cute little traveling outfit. So first, I'm gonna try on the most important item, which is going to be the dress for the wedding. See what this looks like. I'm a bit nervous. Nervous. This is what it looks like. Oh, oh, that's sheer. Oh. That. Oh, this is completely see-through. This is completely see-through. That's the actual dress though? Yeah. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Clearly. Why would they do that? <laughs> I don't even think I can, I can't try this on. I mean, I can try this on, but it won't be on camera because it's yeah. see-through. And this is what it looks like in the back. I just think that you shouldn't overcomplicate things. If you can't find a slip or something to wear under that, just wear the ones you wore to the other one. You know, what's the point of, you said you, only, you would only wear it to the wedding, so. Sure. If you have more time. But I already see. wore the dress in multiple times. I just... Yeah, but if you have more time, it'd be, we have a different conversation. 
I am frustrated with this one, but I love this dress. It's really cute. So this outfit, super cute. I love everything about it. The body, oh no, I don't know. I'm gonna do this because I think you can see through it. Um, these are the pants. They're so cute. The pants are adorable. They fit so well. They're very comfortable and loose, so good for summer days in the bodysuit. I've gotten a black one like this, so I just love the feeling of it. It's like a ribbed bodysuit. It's really soft, so works well. We like it. And it has pockets. <laughs> like, that is adorable. I love this. Love this. So this is going with... It's just like a cute, cash, like, lady outfit. So, love it. Last thing, I only got three outfits. So last thing and then we're, we're done. So this is the last outfit. I have been looking for this one, looking at this one for a while and then it finally went, it was on sale, but then it went more on sale. I think it was $41 for the full set. And then I had like an extra coupon code. I used Leah's coupon code and then I used the extra coupon code, girl, I don't know. I used uh, all the coupon codes that they had. This top is just a little bit big. Like this is supposed to be a size small. Why is this so big? Now the pants, girl, oh, oh, babe. They're cute, but I don't want anything like, I just wanted something cozy and cute, possibly to travel in. And what I'm thinking about doing though with this top it's like wearing this like with, I wanna wear this outfit with like another top and then tie this around my, you know what I'm saying? Tie it around my neck, like Carlton style. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what you call that, but this is cute. I think with, I think it's cute. It just looks big. It's really big. Um, and these pants are kind of short, but I don't know. I need to figure some stuff out. Now the last two, out, like this one and the other one, were good. So all I had to do is, if I can find a slip, I'm good, but I'm also gonna bring my uh, other dress that I wore to the last wedding. That's my, my husband was right, because I really don't need to make things more difficult. So I'm gonna bring my other dress um, for, that I wore to Angela's wedding. I'm gonna bring it to this one, because why not? If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. I think I wore that dress also in Vegas, so I've worn it twice already. I just don't want to wear it again. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to figure some stuff out. Get packed. I'm gonna get packed now and then I have to edit. What are the other things I need to do? I need to sit down and think about all the stuff I need to do because I've been doing things in pieces. I need to do my lashes, do my fingernails, already partially packed, so get packed, edit. I think that's it. It's, not, it's really not that much. Time to finish packing, and I guess I'll see y'all maybe once I calm down. Like, once I get everything situated, then, you know, then we'll be good. But. I'm just rolling out stuff, so I always make a mess. Yeah. But I'm not returning anything, so. Everything's going with me. I liked everything. Shout out to J Lux Label. They don't have any affiliate codes, so all the links that you see, girl, there's no affiliate links. It's just, if you want it, we're get it. Anyways, I'll leave a link for everything that I tried on down below if they still have it, because some of this stuff was on sale. So if they still have it, I'll leave a link for it down below. But if you don't see it, they don't have it. I probably will let you know if they don't have it, girl. Oh, did I tell you my ponytail fell out? I was getting ready this morning and I had my ponytail on. I thought I was cute, I was swaying it. I said, why does this thing feel like it's 32 inches when it's like 16? Baby was all the way down here falling out of my head. So that's why I'm out there with the, the deer tail, the nub. All right, I'll see y'all in a second. Hey y'all, today is, ooh, Friday, September 8th. And we are headed out to, um, North Carolina, I'm fully dressed. Show y'all what we look like over here. Girl, not my tub in the background. This is the outfit. This is the outfit from J Looks Label. I really like it. It's way too hot for this. So I have a bodysuit under here. The only thing is that it's black. So it's making the back look more see-through. So I'm keeping this on for now, but we'll be in the car. Hopefully it's a little bit cooler up in North Carolina, but yeah, so. 
We are getting ready to head out. Oh, all of my bags are packed. This seems like a lot of stuff, but it's just filming stuff. And oh, that's testy. I got um, no, no, camera no, stuff, no. all that type of stuff. So, anyways, made my smoothie, made my breakfast. And for breakfast, I'm just gonna have a smoothie shake, a smoothie. We're gonna head out and maybe like, hopefully, like five minutes. We're supposed to leave at 12, but we're probably gonna leave. Mm. See y'all in a second. Finally, girl. Uh, how do you open this? The tub moves? Girl, what type of cloth what tub is this? We made it to the room um, and I have to rush to get ready because we have a rehearsal dinner at six o'clock, but it was traffic, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, this is the bathroom. It's so gorgeous in here, but we gotta get ready, so. I tried to open that, but they don't work. Mm -hmm. I have to throw on some makeup real quick. We're not checking out tomorrow. You know what I mean? We're not checking out tomorrow. Yeah, out of the balcony now. We only got this for one night. Oh, I forgot. Wait, why well, I forgot that we didn't do two nights? It wouldn't allow us to uh, go two nights straight. Hey y'all, so we, I think, I don't remember the last time I talked to y'all, I think I was getting ready to come to the rehearsal dinner. So they just did the rehearsal and the run through. So I think you're basically done, right? Yeah. It was, it's a beautiful venue. It's gorgeous out here. Like it's so pretty. It's like an industrial park sort of place. What is this called? Like West Side, what's West, so, West Station. Station, Station West. Yeah, Station West in North Carolina, Charlotte. Yeah, that's gorgeous. They don't have the windows rolled up, but you can see the city over there. I guess they're waiting to clean up, and now we're just gonna, after this, we're gonna head out. Go to dinner. We only ate, only ate like a couple pieces of turkey, well, one whole slice of turkey, and what I have, some chicken. You say he would say refinery. He said factory. Like, how did you learn that whole word? I love that this view was actually really nice for it to be like a little factory. See? Okay, so this is my outfit, huh? Purple for it. I'm gonna pull up over here. Are you gonna pull up? So this is the outfit I have on. The pants from J Lux. Y'all saw me try on this outfit yesterday. The pants are from J Lux label. So cute, very, very comfortable. They don't aggravate my acid reflux. The top is from Jay Looks Label. Hopefully I'm not sweating on it because when I get around a whole bunch of people, I start sweating. I don't even know why it's annoying. And I have on my, um, what shoes are these? Fendi, my Fendi sandals for now, but I have heels in the car. I don't even like my heels. I should have brought, see this is the time where I could have matched and I should have brought my Fendi heels, but I didn't, so. Um, my husband's pulling up the car and this battery is about to die so we need to go back to the hotel I want to show y'all the room it's so cute the room is adorable so um, I can't wait to get back to the room to show you what it looks like we only have the suite for one night so yeah oh yeah and I'm wearing it with this bag because this is all I packed I should have brought another bag but I didn't have time to change so I guess we're going to head out. Bye, Trevor. Why would I take this way? I was going to hop down those stairs. <laughs> Why was I going to do that? <laughs> What's going on? 
I was about to hop down those stairs. Like, what's going on with me? We are in the room. We're back in the room from, come on, Chin. We're back in the room from, um, from the wedding venue. The room has already been used up. Girl, we ran up in here and we only have this room for one night. So we're gonna try and make the most of it. But this room is so freaking cute. It is adorable. And we really wanted to get some uh, footage in here, but girl it's just like it's been so busy it's been crazy busy but maybe tomorrow i'll be able to get it i don't know but either way i'm gonna pour my husband up a cocktail how come you don't have no fridge like they got this tiny little fridge over here close okay put my husband's wine in the fridge so yeah girl all i had was a turkey slice but let me go ahead and show you all the room this is going to be like not a room tour but a room tour but y'all y'all can already see the vibes are vibing so i'm gonna give a like a real room tour later but right now we're gonna do this room tour so you're gonna walk in this is the door the ivy little map there little mirror here this is me and my slacks looking like a lady okay this is the bathroom the toilet closet is to the right and i've been trying to get these um blinds open but they won't open and i want the view from there and that cloth with tub everything okay so we're gonna walk in this way and my husband was ironing but we have a little work desk here and this is the full suite the room they did the turn down service which we love so we did the turn down service that is the view we're on the second floor so it's not that high but the lighting in here is fantastic it's gorgeous in here so yeah and this is the bar this is where we've been at the bar so we have two um what do you call those what do you call a closet a boudoir i don't know and a seating area here and the bed here and we have a balcony so there's like a little window over here and then we have a full balcony right here and it is long honey it is long honey yeah it is long i would have i was looking forward to sitting out but because my husband has to be a groomsman in the morning i don't know if we'd be able to sit out here there's like a little club over there is that a club what is that but it's gorgeous out here so while we were driving i felt like we were being followed by a police officer while we were driving through north carolina we had to go through a back road to get to where we needed to go so um while we were driving oh now me sounding like I'm, oh while we were driving through this back road um it was like confederate flag girl that sort once we got through the back roads behind us was a police car and they were pulled back some like they were reading plates that's how i felt there was reading plates and then they followed us all the way through charlotte until we got to not charlotte wherever city we were at was that south carolina i don't know but by the time we got to so we finally were about to leave the town and get on the highway and as soon as we're leaving the town they turn left but they follow us through every little street it was left right left right left right they followed us all the way through i did not quite like that i didn't like that at all so yeah but it was nice we had fun meeting the fam um i was able to meet the beautiful brides family i hadn't met them before and we're able to meet friends and some fam obviously there's a lot of family there so gorgeous aunt all of that so yeah it's been great girl we were it's been a whole rush around so yeah and now we're just relaxing i'm about to turn on some music probably put it on my husband's phone boy my husband has his own phone 
Am I connected to this Bluetooth? <coughs> Let me see if I can hit, hook up the music. <coughs> we have dinner reservations at 9.30. But um, it's 8.52 right now. What do I do? It's 8.52 right now. We forgot our speaker, but thank God they have a speaker in the room. I'm gonna turn that on, have a couple drinks, and celebrate this gorgeous wedding. What is this on my leg? Do I have stuff on my pants? Oh, whatever. I don't care. But these pants don't crease. Like, this is cute. I don't think they crease in the. Well, they crease a little bit, but it's not too bad. I'm out here looking like a lady. Can I see your phone? I hook your phone up. Oh. I'm gonna hook your phone up. I put your wine in the fridge. I was able to fit it in there. Just be careful, be careful when I open it. Oh, this is for the turndown. This, this is for the turndown. This is chocolate. It's so, crazy. Mm -hmm. it's so crazy how many people are outside. I know, it's insane. It's like, we really wanted to stay at the JW Marriott, but the room that we wanted, somebody had already gotten it. So, now hopefully, our next room has. A docking station. Come on. Don't play with me. We made it to dinner. We're at Dean's. Huh, finally. It's been, finally. It's it's been like a hectic day. It's just gonna be a hectic day to be able to relax. It's for fam, you know? Anything for fam. So cheers. Almost 100K. We're at 99.899. Soon to be nine, 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 all nines. All nines. Oh, I'm so proud of my gorgeous pair. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to y'all. I'm so excited. I yes, I'm so be. thankful for everybody that supports. Yeah. I'm always a mirror. The mirror works really hard. And she really appreciates it. I do. Love you guys. I just saw Nunio coming, you girl. All. No, you remember Nunio? Yeah, of course. She was. Rocking with when we did the um, Amazon lives when he's cooking and, and burning stuff, and it was really supportive. So yes, she was really appreciated. Hey, sorry, <laughs> could I have the um baked crab cake? Could I have that with no limit? Is that possible? No like, limit, no, like no limit at all. Yeah, it's just on the side, but yeah, I'll just yeah, no limit. And do y'all have like a side of fries at all? Can I just have a side of, yeah, regular fries, yeah. Are you gonna do anything else? Um, no. Okay. I don't know if I should get two of these. Yeah, you should just get two. Okay, I'll get another. I'll get two of these. You do the tuna crudo. Italian salad. Italian salad? Yes, please. I will do the uh, petite filet, please. Uh, medium rare, please. And I think that should be good. Do you guys live in the area? Uh, from Atlanta. Yeah, we just drove in like literally today. We left at one, hit a bunch of traffic. Supposed to be here at like 320, got here about 530. And then uh, had a wedding rehearsal to go to. Good enough. I was gonna tell you about the tuna crudo. I had a Philly tuna crudo last night. I don't know why. Okay, yeah, let's we'll check that one out. And like small plates, like we're switching to. Oh, okay. And also, can I do the meatballs, please? Yeah. Yes, awesome. Sorry, I was just thinking if I was gonna try it out. You guys want bread on the table? Uh, no, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ooh, girl. I don't know if y'all can hear me. I think the mic would allow you to hear me, but I'm so excited. I think right now. There's been a full countdown this whole time. So right now we're at, we're almost hitting 99.9. .9. I feel like I want to vomit. I'm so excited. I didn't know that, I'm not sure if it'll happen while we're up here, but I just uploaded my Amazon wig haul. So I'm excited. <sighs> Charlotte has been crazy busy. So we've been like running around. We have this beautiful suite that I showed y'all, but we haven't been able to relax in the room at all. So that kind of sucks. I also wanted to open the window where the bathroom was and it don't work, whatever. So, but Charlotte is really, really nice. I like Charlotte. I'm so happy we we're able to come. I like Charlotte. 
I just wanted to tell y'all, I truly appreciate y'all. I don't know how many times I'm gonna say that in this video, but I truly appreciate y'all. I am just on a cloud right now, celebrating this lead up to 100K. It's just been exciting and looking around at how my life has changed. Right after I quit my job, y'all have been amazing. So I just want to thank you while I have a moment, truly. There's never been a day that has passed that I feel like I'm not grateful for y'all. Every single day. I kneel. Who else? Sandra, Sutton, Holla at the Kid, Nunio, oh, that's my girl. Everybody that leaves comments. Like, y'all are just. I just love y'all so much. I'm not gonna cry. And of course, we're celebrating with Class Hazel. And we have a beautiful wedding to go to tomorrow. It's just so, we're so blessed and so grateful that. That's insane. It's crazy that leading up to this event, I had the worst depressive episode. And now we're here. So it's crazy. The time to be. Wow. That's what I was just talking about. Yeah. I was just talking about how, like, you know, since I quit my job yeah. to now, it's insane. Yeah. Like how much things have like, grown and changed because of how they are supportive and all that type of stuff. Like it's insane. Yeah, they got you here and just really appreciate it. Yeah. yeah. It's crap cake. Crap cake. You wanna taste it? Uh, yeah. You wanna taste this crab cake? Uh, yes. Perfect, huh? I put your wine in the fridge though. So. It's cold water, it's cold pot. I want to see what these fries are about. You got everything though? Mm huh? -hmm. It's a good skin fries. It's like McDonald's fries. That's a good skin fries. Do you want to try something? Yeah, by. I'm asking for one more. Uh, one more. It's just like McDonald's fries. It's just like McDonald's fries. Oh my god. Oh, he killed that mosquito on the wall. Now I gotta clean this up. Girl. So we're back in the room. Oh, the camera's about to die. So we're back in the room. They're chilling outside. Baby, when I tell you, it's like a college town. But I was saying that, um, girl, it is the people I showed y'all outside. It is party central over here. Now, where we're staying at the Ivy, it's like really quiet. Um, there's like no partying allowed in the room, none of that. So, baby, we thought. We thought it was gonna be something cute. The girls are out here partying at this club over here and the girls is looking for men's. And I don't know what's going on, but babes, y'all, don't we, we had somebody ask us to come up to our balcony. Yeah, we're just standing outside drinking and the guy's like, he literally was like, no, for real, let me come up there. No. <laughs> Today's been a day and I'm exhausted. I need to do my skincare routine. I already took off my wig, but I don't know if I'm gonna take this wig off or leave it on for tomorrow. It depends on my outfit. Like if my outfit is see-through, I'm not gonna wear it, but I really wanna wear that outfit. I really want to wear that outfit, but I may wear it tomorrow for dinner. Maybe that'll work. 85 more subscribers, girl, and I will be at 100K. Once I see that 100K, I think I'm gonna cry. I think I'm gonna cry. So excited. I'm so excited. Oh, I wish I can open these blinds right here, but I can't. Like these right here, the remote don't work. It's making a sound. And I would love to take a picture in this bathtub, but it won't let me. I wanna be like this.
but they oh i didn't tell y'all they upgraded us so we only have this room for one night and they upgraded us to this should not work i really have wanted this to work but it don't I don't know if our executive suite has a claw foot tub, but I want to use it. So now I think I need to do, am I going to shower? Am I going to keep this wig on? The wig looks good. So I don't know if I feel like taking the wig off. Do I have any, I think I have some curlers. What am I going to do? I gotta take this makeup off. And taking off my makeup is a whole full-time job. And I don't know if I'm going to wear, I guess it depends tomorrow. What wig am I wearing? Because I have an OMG her hair wig that I brought with me that I could wear. So I don't know. I feel like I look tight. Yard, you hear me? But this bathroom is cute. This shower is real cute. I need to use it so I can wash my damn face. Since we paying for the room, use it for everything she got. Okay. Y'all know I love treating the wig like it's my hair and pulling it back and being exhausted. Oh. Come on, ponytail. Ooh. Yes, ponytail. Thinking about, but if I use my moisturizer on this or my cleanser, I'm going to end up taking off my makeup and then taking off my wig. So, either I can reapply this tomorrow early in the morning. Ooh, I got a plan. I'm gonna use cotton swabs with my makeup removal and then wash my face with my zinc facial wash. I also need to shower. Ugh. But I don't know if I wanna take off this wig because this wig is from RPG Hair. It stayed curled since the last time I wore it, which was, when was that? I don't even know. But I put it in the storage bag and it still looked like this. I didn't curl it, nothing. So it looks so realistic. Like the girls can't even, the girls can't even believe it. So I don't know. Any hoosies, thank you for dating up with NK. Let me do my skincare routine because I need to get out of this makeup. But how am I? The girls, do you, I don't know if y'all hear that, but it's like a party outside. But I'm definitely gonna pull my hair back. Do I have like an elastic band that I can tie around? Hold on, let me find that. Okay, so right now I'm listening to Julesy while I do my skincare routine. The way this bathroom is eating this look up. Oh, and the way my lace is coming up is no, no bueno. Girl, no bueno. My husband got cotton swabs. I think he do. One thing I can depend on is my man to have everything that I need. He gonna have cotton swabs, he gonna have ear swabs. My husband gonna have everything. He don't play about his hygiene. I know that's right. Shout out to the man that don't play about their hygiene. I know that's right. Tomorrow, I need my makeup to be done. What are the, what are the, this is called a beauty caddy. I need to actually take off my whites because this is about to be a real mercy. Got my cotton swabs and I'm gonna use the Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser to take off my makeup. I don't know if I'll end up taking off my wig. If I end up taking off my wig, it'll be by mistake. If it come off, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> but I'm gonna wet my, wet this and then take a little bit of this gentle skin cleanser. Oh, not on the floor. I'm just gonna, I actually didn't put on a lot of makeup. I don't know if you saw. But thank God, in time for this wedding, my skin couldn't be good because I 
didn't have time for a lot of makeup from all the running around that we're doing. Let me take this off. All the running around that we're doing. I don't have time for that. And we're supposed to get up tomorrow morning and have breakfast. Ooh. Is that the air? Because baby, it's cold. Am I gonna take a shower in here? I should, because I feel dusty. I just took a shower this morning. But when you travel, you gotta take another shower, so. First layer of makeup, gone. But why isn't there a trash can in here? Is it in the toilet closet? Yeah. I'm gonna do the second. Ooh. <laughs> why do I have hiccups? See this this coloration you see right there right there and right here all of this was rashed up like baby i was going through it down here it started to rash the only part that i didn't really have any like i had a rash all over my freaking face that's what i was saying when we're at dinner i didn't finish what i was saying um it's crazy that i went through i felt like it was like a mini depression like it felt I didn't want to say it was a full depression but I was in a very very low state for months maybe since last year maybe October and it's been a year September now um I've been in a very low spot and finally I feel like I'm coming out of it and it's been a year but it's been low like I didn't even I never experienced depression before I'm more I feel like I worry more about the future than the past so I feel like anxiety but it was recently with like current things that were happening in my life that had me experiencing depression and I was on my way to 100k so it feels like now that this is all clearing I feel like I'm getting to the other side as I get clarity in my life and it's crazy I'm just grateful my husband always says there's no sweet without the sour and I agree yeah there can be sweet but like how like I feel how sweet it is don't know how I got through that I really don't it was just low every day why am I crying I'm only crying because I'm grateful because it was so hard but I got my makeup off Ooh, not me crying girl you see how pink I never turned like this is my skin tone in the winter time like that brown what is this honey it just felt like it was not stopped now for the end of the tunnel to be 100k it's just like it's kismet shout out to y'all i'm not gonna cry y'all so i need to jump in the shower and Get myself clean. Girl, there's a whole mess out there. We saw a fight between a guy and a girl. There's a whole bunch going on out there. My husband is walking back with his brother to his hotel. So we're gonna go ahead and get in the shower and then we're gonna come back out and do our skincare routine. So are you clean? I took the makeup off my face with um this Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser. Now my dermatologist recommended this to me. If you have dermatitis, she said this doesn't have any chemicals, it's no astringents, so this is good for you. So I've been using this. And then I go in, secondly, I go in with this Cetaphil, Cetaphil Derma Control Oil Removing Foam Wash. I'm not gonna use this in the shower. I'm gonna use this outside of the showers, but I need to jump in the shower while my husband is out so we can change and we can get into that so let's get y'all we are headed out to breakfast i didn't put my eyebrows on so please excuse my face <laughs> but we're headed out to breakfast oh it's been uh, oh, yeah it's been long okay where am i we're headed out 
and then to, we have to change rooms so we're gonna have breakfast first and then come back and change rooms hopefully our second room will be ready i'm gonna miss this room but hopefully our next room is just as cute i think so it's just the balconies but we're about to head out now i'm gonna show y'all what i'm wearing later because we got to go we're already late ish not really I want to make sure I have this card. Oh, yeah, this one. So I don't have to. So I don't worry about it. Yeah, but. I'm planning on coming back. Oh, of course. I'll be right over Okay, y'all. So, I think the last time I talked to y'all, we probably were at breakfast. I'm not sure if I talked to y'all at breakfast, but right now, we are packing up the room and he has to go and get pictures with the groom he has to go do pictures so i'm gonna go drop him off and i'm gonna come back to the room and move to our next room which is the king executive suite there is no balcony but this balcony is like i showed y'all it's a really nice balcony but right now i'm repacking a little bit can i put this right here yeah i'm repacking for us to move to the new room but we can stay in this room until uh, but we're almost to 100k 30 more 30 more subscribers and we'll be at 100k it's so exciting i know isn't it crazy what time is it okay yeah he'll be there at 11 30. oh do i need to oh no our car is out front yes <clears throat> hey y'all oh my god so i was i'm heading back from dropping off my husband use the left lane to turn left on west brooklyn village avenue oh. I'm heading back to from dropping my husband off at um, dropping my husband off at the venue so he can take pictures with the groomsmen. Um, I was gonna go to Target, but we're in like I think we're in like Charlotte downtown, Midtown. I'm not really sure. I think we're downtown Charlotte. So I was going to turn left on West Brooklyn Village Avenue. I was going to see if I could go to um, Target because I want to get some shapewear because I really want to wear that dress. I really want to wear that dress, but I don't think I'll be able to wear that dress. Plus, I need to get back to. Plus, I need to get to the hotel. To. It's saying no left though. But it should be fine. In 300 feet. Use the left lane to turn left. I'm not gonna be looking around for shapewear to wear this dress. It's not that serious. So it's fine. I really like this black interior. I'm so used to the like the cognac interior. I love this black interior. I freaking love it. And I love this BMW X5. Shout out to the girls that have an X5. This is a lot of space. She moves like a bus though. Why do people be pulling in the garage so slow? The girls just turn. That's all. You ain't got a turn like that. Y'all ain't got rims or nothing. Baby, it's so many people walking around. Like, what is going on? It's nice out here, though. Oh, there's McCormick and Schmix. How am I going to get to the Ivy? I'm going to have to make a left. And then come back up. Because I have to get to Valet. I'm gonna have to turn y'all off and see y'all once we get back in the room. We may be just moving rooms. The thing about it, a downtown is gonna give you one way after one way to make sure you can't get where you need to go. I should have just pulled up. I was being way too difficult, but I'm gonna make a right. I think I know where I'm going. I'm gonna make a right and then another right and pull up on try on because we're staying at the Ivy's on try on. So how how did I end up lost like this? Oh my god. Okay, so I'm back in the room and I am going to try on the dress. Girl, I was lost as sauce. I was lost on sauce. I was sauce and lost. Girl, I don't know. I'm getting sauce right now. I'm having a drink, having a cocktail while I wait for our new room to be ready. They're so, when I tell you, when I tell you they're so nice here at the Ivy, Rondell, and I forgot the other young lady's name. 
but they both were so kind i mean rondell has been a gem so shout out to rondell i don't know if you're gonna hear me but rondell has been very very kind very nice very sweet very accommodating i just i would definitely stay here again if we ever came back to charlotte but i don't think we would but i like the city now i'm gonna try on this dress because when i tried it on at home so what i did is i brought some shorts to wear under this and it's like a similar color so i'm trying to see if it's still see-through because i really want to wear this dress y'all know how bad i want to wear this dress how bad i really want to wear it so i mean most likely i would change into it for tonight but i just don't I don't want to be inappropriate i don't want to look like you know i'm doing too much at somebody's wedding i don't want to do that that's the last thing i want to do but i do not want to wear that other dress it's too hot it's like silk silk makes me sweat so so i'll be back if it's see-through it's see-through girl i can't wear it i gotta deal with it so i have the dress on and i want to see if you can see through it i'm gonna go outside it's just not bright out which is good for me but i want to see trying to see can you see through it friend the world is party on let me see okay after looking at it you can see my legs in silhouette so i think i'm gonna do something different they have a sewing kit in here and they have um scissors so what i'm gonna do is get to sewing i know how to sew like enough to you know make things look right so the sewing kit is this is so, these chairs are so low this is the sewing kit they give and it comes with all these needles and stuff so i'm about to use it i'm gonna cut these pants to where it looks like a skirt so underneath you won't see my legs will it work i think it will let's get to work friend because i'm not playing around okay so um we're in the new room and the last room was cute because of the balcony but this room hits rondell showed out okay what oh girl what what okay let me open up these okay let me open up these ones i'm hot you know y'all know how i get um like hot when i'm interacting with people because i have anxiety i have like what's weird is that i'm comfortable with interacting with people but i still get like anxious and i start sweating sweat sweat i was telling rondell downstairs i said you know what i got anxiety so i don't know <laughs> i'm sweating i'm weird it makes me feel like awkward but either way everybody was so nice like i really do i think david rondell and the young lady last night i really do hate that i forgot her name but i think my husband remember her name but i'm gonna do a room tour right now my husband is gone and i really wish he could see this room i text him i really wish he could see this room i really do but it's fine uh, let's see what am i what am i even doing somebody help me like are you kidding are you freaking kidding me what and they upgraded us for free i've never been upgraded for free never happened to me i seen the girls that had that happen to him lucky girls but i ain't never had that happen for me so where is the like how do you where let me not run around this room but i'm like are you kidding this is huge how how do i open the drape there's like a button somewhere. No? Drapes? Drapes? No. No drapes. Do I just open them? I feel like that'll work. Which way do I open them at? 
Oh, they just, girl, <laughs> not me being highfalutin trying to figure out how to do this. What side of the street is this? Where are we at, Basil? <gasps> there is sweat dripping down my back. <gasps> Oh, this is disgusting. Baby, I need to get in the shower. Oh, this is disgusting. But oh, you can't see the sweat. Thank freaking God. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, they say big bathroom. Hey, girl, so I wasn't supposed to leave. Why is this not? I wasn't supposed to leave, but we're almost at 100K and I could not, I cannot celebrate 100K without my husband. Like I cannot, and he's at the venue, so I'm going to him and we're going to celebrate. <laughs> oh my God, and I got a cocktail in the trunk because we were supposed to be together at this time because we thought the wedding started at four, but like things changed. So yeah, girl, I'm not playing these games. If you think I'm gonna celebrate without my man, the man that has been there for me this whole time, like, baby, I could cry. I'm headed up to see my man. It's giving very much romantic movie. Are these parking spots? Like, what's going on? It's giving very much romantic movie. I'm rushing to my... <laughs> it's a lot. But right now, I'm at 99 points. Let's see, where are we at? I'm gonna wait till I get to a light. Use the right lane to turn okay. right on West 4th Street. Baby, I'm starting to get to know Charlotte at this point. The amount of times. Oh, that room is gorgeous, though. So I'm at. In 1.9 miles. At the roundabout, take the first exit on Berry Hill Road. Why are you driving so slow, baby? What is going on? It's at 995. I have five more subscribers to go. Baby, we're not missing it. I'm not missing this. This is so exciting. I need to turn on this air. It is hot. Hopefully, this air be so loud. Like, they don't have like regular air in this thing. How do I pull behind these slow cars? Ain't no rush, girl. I can chill because I got five more subscribers left. When I was in the, when I was in the um, room, it was um, eight more subscribers, so it's moving fast. <gasps> I want to cry. I didn't think I was gonna feel like I was gonna cry. I did really didn't think that. Mm. Why am I about to cry? What is going on? I'm not on my period, girl. Let me take a second. Ooh. Nine, nine, as soon as you walked up. Nine, 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 What was a K? That is so crazy. Oh, I'm so proud of my little gorgeous bear. I'm so proud of you. My works bears work so hard. I'm so proud of my little gorgeous bear. This is a lot. You did so uh, work so hard to get this spot. And it's just moving on up because this thing is firing off because it's a short on my bread. My uh, bear, I'm so proud of my little gorgeous bear. I can get some. My tears. <laughs> Are you hot? No, I'm not worried about it. Cheers. 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 I'm going to go get my bear some tissue. Cheers. Cheers. My bear did it. So proud of my bear. Oh, well, my life. did it. Hashtag best friends. <laughs> best friends. Hashtag love my lifetimes. <laughs> Bears. Oh my goodness. 
I'm gonna celebrate tonight. Yes. Yes. Let me go get you some tissue. I know, because my whole face is no. wet. I should have brought some. I got you. I'll be right back. I can't. I can't be online look like this. Okay, y'all, I'm back in the room. I have to get ready. Like, it is two o'clock, and I'm supposed to be at the wedding by four. I need to shower. I'm probably not gonna change my hair. I really wanted to, but that's not important. What is important is wearing this dress. I'm gonna wear the dress I want. Girl, I don't even, like, I had to take a moment and turn off the camera because 100K, 100,000, thank you so much. I'm not gonna cry again. Sick of crying. It burns my face because of my dermatitis. <laughs> but I'm sick of crying. I mean, I'm it's happy tears, but oh my God. I, a hundred thousand, a hundred thousand, one hundred thousand. I don't think, I can't even put that number into freaking words. Like I'm just like not, I don't even know what to say but i know i'm happy <laughs> i know i'm elated i'm gonna put my husband's stuff does he need a hold i wonder if i should put his stuff in the closet because he don't like his stuff too creased baby and now i gotta get myself ready and i need to sew up it could take it takes me nothing to sew up some um shorts i think it would take me what 15 20 minutes so I'm not really worried about that. Mm. Those are his shoes. Mm. Now, what do you do with his clothes? Oh yeah, hang this stuff up. You know, since he's at the wedding, being a good cousin, I need to make sure he is set up. I need to text my mother-in-law back. He probably, girl, that's on two separate hands. Get me out of here. <laughs> I should do housewife classes. <laughs> girl, I'm good at these. Housewife status, me. Okay, period. Now let me get myself together. Y'all ever unpack your man's bag? Cause we unpack our own bag. We don't do that over here. <laughs> I don't know if I better he going pack his bag. That's it. But I want the room to stay clean, so. His stuff is tucked away, ready to go. Figure out. I need to get my dress first and figure that out. Like, what am I gonna do with this dress? Oh, okay. Um, I'm wearing this dress. I'm wearing it. So, I need to... Do they have that same desk? Let me see if I can stitch this together real quick. And I need to turn on some music. I need to find a way to connect to the Wi-Fi. Oh no, I think this is a desk. Oh, this is a desk. This is the same desk. That has scissors in it. Yes. Girl, they got a whole office kit in here on the desk. See? I can use this. Um, I'm just going to cut it down the middle and then sew the cross together. So, see if I can do this. I'm not really worried about it. Because if it don't work out, girl, I got another dress. But I really want to wear this dress. I actually like these pants for naked wardrobe too, but come on. Oh, these are definitely not fabrics for this child. Okay. I'll make this a skirt. I could have just went to Target, it's seven minutes away, but I have to get on the highway. And I'm not getting on the highway that real far. No, ma'am. Okay, so I'm gonna turn it inside out and I'm gonna get to sewing together. Oh, this will be easy peasy, living squeezy. Hello? Girl, this is gonna be easy. So I'm just gonna sew together. It's gonna be a skirt. Sew it together like that. Should be no problem just sew this part together i'm gonna do that real quick and i'm gonna come back and it's gonna be ready girl i found my i made myself a slit okay i don't even know what time it is i need to start checking the time box i don't have time to check the time where's the sewing kit they got another sewing kit so i got two two sewing kits got two sewing kits so i'm gonna sit behind my behind down 
have a little cocktail. I really have to use the restroom, but I don't have time to pee. And they already have the thread threaded. That's like, it's not the hardest part, but it's the most annoying part. <laughs> I could cry again. I'm not crying because my face cannot burn. It's 2.26. Oh girl, I got like an hour. Why am I doing this? I did it in like a couple minutes. So this is gonna be my slip. Oh girl, this body is bodying. I ain't eat that much. So, but girl, it's a little bit cattywampus, but all I need is something to cover so it doesn't look like you can see between here. Like that was just inappropriate. But I think this is good. And I could pull this down in the back. Oh, good, okay. So now I gotta get ready. Girl, I got like 45 minutes get ready wait 3 30 i gotta be completely ready so completely ready in 45 minutes we can do it don't worry about me girl i'll get it done okay let's get it done i did a room tour but before my husband gets here i want to show y'all what the room looks like okay so this is what it looks like here um this is when you walk into the door so this is the door gorgeous gorgeous at the ivies Okay, first you walk in. Here is a bathroom. Girl, I still got on my slip, so. <gasps> my battery's about to die. What's that sound? Toilet. Okay, that's the bathroom. I'll show y'all quickly. This battery's about to die. TV. Bye. Yes, I was in the living room area. Big, big couch. You walk in through these doors. We're getting into the bedroom. Boom, bathroom, absolutely gorgeous. Before I mess this up, I want to show y'all. Love the same marble that we had in the other, or the marble texture. Girl, what is going on? Okay, this is this, what is this, the toilet closet? Oh, it's a big toilet closet, cute. Okay, and this is what it looks like in the bathroom, very big, and then we go this way and we have the bedroom you already saw the wardrobe that's what it's called the wardrobe here and this is the room very cute lovely and our view is of the street so it's it'll be more quiet over here when we get more sleep and yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and jump in the shower do my makeup i'm gonna keep this wig on i'm not playing Okay, I'm not playing those games. Jump in the shower, do my makeup, throw all my clothes, get out of here. And then I need to have my brother-in-law come. It's a lot to do, friend. A lot to do, but I can do it. And I'm over here wasting time. I, this is where ADD comes in. Or I don't even, like, I don't even know what, what I'd be thinking, you know? I've been sweating. I don't know if I'm gonna shower. Like I'm thinking about not showering and just doing my makeup, but I just can't do that. I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to not shower. Like how does that work before you go somewhere? Like I, don't, I just have to shower, especially as much as I was sweating. <gasps> okay, I'm a mess. Okay, girl, I'm not even being a mess. I'm so excited. <sighs> but we should be fine. I feel like I'm fine. I feel like I'm fine. Rainy as hell outside. Not going anywhere, so we don't have one of these people, right? Cheers. You got my head cut out. Oh. Oh, back this up. back from the wedding. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. And we just got back from the wedding and it's raining out now. We're supposed to go to dinner at what's the Our name of the restaurant? Rooftop. Oh yeah, it was yeah. a rooftop. It was a rooftop but now it's storming. It's storming so, so yeah. I've dropped that out the ranks. Restoration Hardware, you know it's a French store. Is it? Restoration Hardware Hardware is a French store. Okay. Uh, like a high end furniture store, but they also have a Oh no, yeah, I knew that, yeah. yeah. I didn't know they uh, oh I didn't know they had a restaurant. Just, uh, I didn't know that was, that was a I think it's only certain cities that have it. But we were supposed to go there. It's just it's like completely right like it is. Oh yeah, it is bad out there, so 
Um, we're just gonna eat here. We're at Sophia's. Lo what is it? Sophia's Lounge. Sophia's Lounge. Yeah. Where's Sophia's Lounge? It's a restaurant in the hotel. I'm not gonna eat too much of this waffle, but. Mm -hmm. Chicken is fire. You want to get any fries? I thought that. Yeah, but you got fries. Hmm? I feel like. You got the fried and all that. Mm -hmm. That's why I call them that. At the room, wedding is over. It was such a beautiful wedding. Shout out and congratulations to the bride and groom, Esther and Gerald. Love you all. Thank you so much for having us there for the most joyous occasion. It was amazing. Now, um, we're just in the room. My husband <clears throat> and his brother, my brother-in-law, they just went to hang out, walking, chilling, and I'm in the room, girl, having a cocktail. How many cocktails did I have today? That's none of your business, okay? None of your business, because we are celebrating, okay? We're celebrating a 100K, I was about to say 80K. Wow. When I tell you that I am like over the moon, it's so crazy because around this date, I hit 10,000 subscribers in 2018. And now it's 100K in 2023. And I think, actually, let me take it on the road. I think that, you know, a lot of people say that 100K doesn't, uh, or numbers don't matter. They matter. They matter. I'm telling you, hitting 100K is such a big deal. And if you hit 100K, please don't let it dim your light. If you hit 10K, please don't let it, please don't be like, oh no, numbers don't matter. They do, it's important. Like the amount of people, the amount of y'all that are actually watching me is like beyond what I could even imagine. Like, it's just like, the fact that I get to do this, like live this life, travel, see my family, see people get married without having to take time off, like it's because of y'all, a hundred thousand of y'all. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just grateful for every single one of you. And I just, I, 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 I have no words. I have no words. I was looking for my cocktail, girl. I'm always losing my cocktail in the room. I think I have fig jelly, baby. We went to Sophia's Lounge. Here it's connected to the Ivy Hotel, so it's right downstairs. They close at one o'clock. So um really enjoyed it there. Our server was really, really nice. And baby, there's a lot of bachelorette parties. The girls was having a time, okay? They was having a time out there. So yeah, I just love being in the room. Like something about being in the room is everything. Is that Audrey Hepburn? Is Audrey ever? This hotel was built in the 1900s. And when I was here by myself, girl, I was creeped out. You say 1900s, I think slavery. Y'all weren't here for us in the 1900s. So I hear built in 1900s, I hear scared. Okay, confused, looking at the pictures. Who are these people? But it's a beautiful room. This definitely reminds me of the room we stayed in in Naples, Florida, in on fifth. Very similar aesthetic very very when i tell you these boutique hotels are clean girl i had to wipe up the floor not a it was like a little bit of dust probably from us walking around in the room literally the floor is spotless spotless and it like blows my mind it is spotless in here what type of cleaning do they do girl i'm not i'm leaning into the background it's my aesthetic today Either way, when I was talking about 100K, what I was saying is it's just like bizarre to even think that we are at 100K and it took me eight years. Like if you are doing this, don't quit. If you're doubting yourself, stop it. Just keep going. And I think the one thing about the 100K that's so important to me 
Let me grab my drink because it makes me feel comfortable. Y'all don't have to have a cocktail. It makes me feel comfortable. I don't know what it is. It's a nervous tick. But the one thing that makes me feel comfortable about the 100K is that I got the 100K how I wanted to. I definitely could have switched gears and went to went the gimmickly went into a lane that I didn't truly believe in or did things on video to build up my subscribers faster but I didn't want to do that what I wanted to do was what I decided to do and what I wanted to do was exactly what I did stay true to what I love you know if you watch my channel I had a journey I tried out different things uh, I used to do insecure reviews and when I watch those I'm like cringe girl what but I did what I wanted to do on my channel and that's how I feel right now I feel like I'm doing what I want to do and I love it and y'all love it so like getting 100k is based off of what I love doing is like it that's what made me cry earlier it's just like grateful I'm grateful for this moment I'm grateful for y'all I'm just grateful for the community and I just had my hell down I oh girl uh, we had a great time I had a great time with my cousin-in-laws like such amazing family shout out to Malika to Sella, my mother-in-law Linda and Aunt Jamila like the whole family Elise we had such a great time today and sometimes I forget and I was talking to my mom about this sometimes I do forget how important it is to be around family lately i have been um just kind of isolating myself trying to get to this 100k goal it was going to happen because i've been fighting for my life trying to get this so i was going to do what i needed to do and my amazing husband was along with that mission with me but it still was it was isolating and i think that added to my depression it added to me feeling alone on top of other things but chasing this goal and doing doing the work that was necessary to get to this goal was an isolating experience and it was so i don't know if it's kismet it was so fitting it was so fitting that today was filled with family love a wedding just being around people that i love and care about it's just for this next year i want to still dedicate my life to my goals but i also want to dedicate my life to building community i want to be good at that i'm not really great at that um my family is really isolated for reasons of you know for my parents isolated us for protection and but that because i didn't grow up with a lot of family building community is like a different it's like a it's strange to me i don't know what it feels like to build relationships outside of my immediate immediate family so building community it's like something new that i'm like it's a new language i'm learning at this ripe old age of 36 girl how old am i 36 37 i dedicated this year to finally get to this goal and i feel like now i want to concentrate on family and it just felt so fitting to move into that next phase because i told myself like once i get this number i want to make sure i fill my life with more love um, i have an amazing family on both sides with my husband's family and my family so i feel like building community should be easier but i have some work to do personally to learn how to do that because i literally don't know how to do that I'm terrible at it, to be honest. And it's not something that's my greatest asset. So it's not an asset at all. Baby, it's a weakness, okay? I'm not crying alone in a room from the 1900s. I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh, oh, girl, the tear dropped. <laughs> Anyways, I was saying, girls, boo -hoo crying. They got LED lights in here. That's the only reason why that those stripes go across the screen. Um, One thing I will tell you is that the reason why I wore the MAC NC50 is because it doesn't, like my makeup wore off, right? But it doesn't like, uh, it's good wedding makeup. When I tell you I got MAC NC50 on my hand and it's been on my hand all day, I washed my hands multiple times today and it's still on my hand. 
all of it will not come off it's so bizarre i don't even know what to do with that like why won't you come off i don't even know what's happening what type of music my husband got it's my husband's home oh and this robe i still got on my dress i just didn't feel like changing girl i'm so tired and they're trying to lure the girls to drink liquor in here i see what y'all doing and we not doing it we're not gonna do that oh and at the wedding girl they had donuts i took two bites and i said no ma'am y'all not gonna get me with this gluten and this sugar y'all know i'm gonna be bouncing off the walls okay or at least bouncing up bouncing off the bed sheets y'all really trying it and the view i showed y'all the view we had but i'm about to open these blinds real quick actually put y'all right here See what these blinds is giving. I shall turn this up in a second because I don't feel like it. They do a turn down service here. And y'all know we love a turn down. Oh my god, my fake titties are on. Like the jelly titties from Amazon. Those things are everything. They don't last that long. But they're everything. Oh. There we go. What the girls doing out there? It's Saturday. The girls is clubbing. We have one. Do I like the ghost of Christmas past standing in this room? <laughs> That's so different looking at it now. It is. I just realized that I did, we didn't even get to get um, footage of we didn't get to get footage of us in the hotel. I had to angle it like this to yeah, straighten yeah. it. So, yeah. 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 I think that's straight. One last thrill. Good morning, y'all. We had to rush and get out of the room. I hate it that we didn't get to, um, I don't think we recorded much in the room because the, by the time the wedding was over, we came back, it just was a whole thing. So the trip was nice. So we're headed to go get some breakfast and then we're headed out three and a half, four hours to get back to Atlanta and then we can be done. Charlotte was actually nice. I was telling the young lady at the front. I like Charlotte. It's cute out here. Definitely different from what I thought it was. So, yeah, I enjoyed it. Baby, these smile lines are taking me out. Still cute, though. Don't even worry about it. Anyways. Um, yeah, there, my husband's checking out um, his brother from his hotel. And then we are on our Checking out my husband, he is so handsome. You can't see him. I feel like, can you see him? You can't see him. Every time I see this man, girl, I'm stuck, okay? How me being in love. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh yeah, for the outfit, I'm wearing the same outfit I wore in. Don't even worry about it, girl. Who's gonna pack an extra outfit? We only have one carry-on, so. I wasn't even worried about trying to get a new outfit. Mm -hmm. Cheers. 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 Oh. Okay, y'all. So we are headed back home. We were at. We went to breakfast and we saw the bride and groom. But well, we had breakfast and then we are headed home now. We're about to head back and 
we're probably gonna get home probably by six if we don't confront that Atlanta traffic. So we'll be home by 6, 6.30. So happy to be home. We're about to go and get something to eat, get some pizza and relax. Today is, we're watching a Dallas Cowboys game. If you don't know, this is a Dallas Cowboys house. So we're gonna be watching the game today, relaxing. And the party is still going, okay? So yeah. Okay. We still have to celebrate it properly. We still haven't done that yet. So we're about to head out now, grab something to eat, come back, watch the game, and just finally relax. Because, oh, we're both exhausted. And he's been driving this whole time. So this was like a test of a week. First of all, the way this hair is looking, I, I don't think I ever curled it. I never curled it on the trip. And this is what it looked like. I just would sleep. Um, in my bonnet and uh, edge wrap, wrap this hair back in the bun and it was just like, look how good it looks. It feels a little bit dry at the end, but it's lasted me for what, two, when did I put this on? This is day three, I think. I definitely, this is one of the ones I need to buy. I need to go on RPG Show's website, buy a couple ways. Top nine, you need something? Um, will you please my Yes. There. Ooh, it's bloated. Careful. Yeah, no, I'm not doing it. You want me to open it? No. You want to open it? Uh, how'd you get there? Uh-huh. You trust me? Uh, you trust me? 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 I want pizza. This is good. Pizza always hits the spot. Hey y'all, so I'm closing out the vlog to start another vlog, but we've ended the trip. Now we're getting gas. We tried to turn in the car, but it was late. So we're turning in the car today, Monday, the day after we got back from North Carolina. So I just wanted to check in with y'all, close out the vlog so we can start a new one. It'll be starting on this day. I'll be wearing the same outfit, so don't talk about me. But yeah, I just wanted to tell y'all, I love y'all. Thank you so much for watching and thank you. Let me look at y'all. Thank you so much for 100K. I truly appreciate it. I've been celebrating, crying. It's been a lot, like it's just been I've been over the moon but anyways I'm gonna go ahead and start the next vlog and I just wanted to tell y'all I love y'all and I'll see you in the next video